time to meet an adoptable pet from the Humane Society of Washington County. It's the podcast on our Live 96.7 social streams, sponsored by Central Dogma, a healthy place for pets naturally. Here's Ryan Smetzer. Well, good morning, y'all. Welcome to another fresh episode of the podcast. I'm Ryan Smetzer, and as always, each and every week, we feature an adoptable pet from the Humane Society of Washington County, sponsored by our friends over at Central Dogma. Today, we've got a great, awesome pet on the podcast, as it is absolutely storming outside of my window here. Say hello to Honey Bunny. Good morning, guys, <laughs> and good morning to Honey Bunny. We've got a rabbit on today's podcast, yeah. and she is simply adorable a very unique bunny though too like just some really interesting features to her as well tell her uh, tell us a little bit about honey bunny this awesome bunny that we got today yeah so honey bunny to her oh maybe her back now so honey bunny is two years old and she is spayed she is a girl who's very um particular about her living space she doesn't really want you to touch her things and she's very into her fitness. I just realized looking at her um, chart here, she's usually out exercising at this time. So she might not really like being in her cage right now. Um, <laughs> she's ready for she her morning her job bar. currently. <laughs> yeah, she's like, what is this? I should be out playing and running. So she would like to have a place where she has like a big living space and also time out of it every day so she can exercise and stay in shape. Um, oh, yes, there we go. That's a beautiful... Ooh. <laughs> Beautiful shot of her. <laughs> <laughs> she keeps a tidy cage. She uses her litter box. She's shy at first, but apparently once you build a bond with her, she'll let you pick her up and feed her treats. I don't have that with her yet, so I'm not going <laughs> to <die. laughs> You're like baby steps, but once you get to that point, it'll be fantastic and you can you can feed her whatever yeah. you want. You can, you know, run around with her maybe, do some laps with her cuz you know, again, yeah. there's just that that athletic prowess there that we've got from from Honey Bunny today. And I love kind of just like she's got like a little like kangaroo pouch thing going on under the chin, yeah. too. Like, especially now that she's laying down, it looks like she has a double chin, which I think is fantastic. <laughs> it looks like a little built in pillow or travel pillow. I don't know. I don't know what that is. Maybe a rabbit expert out there knows. But um, she's got an extra layer of comfort. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, she's. She's beautiful. She's got a beautiful color and she's eight and a half pounds. And um, look at that nose going. <laughs> Amazing. She's rearing to go. Now, if somebody's interested in coming to check out Honey Bunny, um, I know that, you know, kind of the rabbits and the the other animals are, uh, you know, separate from dogs and cats. Kind of how can they go about, uh, you know, stopping by to uh, to see Honey Bunny as she's got her ears up now? I think she knows I'm talking about her. Yes, that actually means that she's happy. So I'm glad to see those ears up. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> yes. Um, so if you want to brave the elements and come out today, we open at one and she's in here with our other small animals. She's the only bunny right now. We've got some guinea pigs. Um, she would preferably go to someone who has experience with rabbits and maybe kids that are older than 10. Um, yeah, but just come on in and the adoption procedure is the same. Give her some time to warm up to you, though. She's yeah. <laughs> particular. She's a Let lady, her... and she knows her worth. <laughs> Let her run around you for a little while, get the, the steam blown off, and then you'll be all good. <laughs> yes. Yes. She's beautiful, though. Amazing. And hey, I know you guys, obviously, with moving into a new month, have some really cool stuff coming up uh, just in time for March. Tell us a little bit about what's going on over there at the Humane Society. Yeah. So a little sneak peek, because this will all be posted today. We are going to announce our March Wagness competition, which will be a fundraiser kind of um, based on voting for alumni pets. So we'll ask people to submit their alumni to be entered to um, participate in March Wagness. And then we also today will be starting our adoption. That's O apostrophe um, <laughs> event. For our, um, do our dogs and cats that have been here over 20 days, cats will be available to adopt for $25 and dogs for 50 And that includes their spay, neuter, microchip, and um, vaccines. We're really full right now, so we're hoping to get some of these guys out the door that have been here a long time. Yeah, especially <laughs> our good pal Honey Bunny here. Like, look, I mean... She's she's Honestly. enjoying a, a good little nap like and she wants to nap maybe in your lap or somewhere there in your home. Um, so yeah. <laughs> it's time to make that happen. 
<laughs> yeah, she's been here a while too. She stayed in foster a little bit, but since she's come back, it's been uh, about a month and a half now. She's been in here waiting, so mm -hmm. and it's her needs, time. She needs an awesome new home, so go snatch up Honey Bunny. I love it. <laughs> yeah, he is really awesome. sleeping. <laughs> I was going to say, like, she is down for the count now this morning. I think we got all of the energy out of her during this episode. And now she just she needs yeah. a nap. Like the camera is just too much for her, you know, it's too much. That's her exercise for the day that took it all out of her. <laughs> Amazing. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, guys. Thank you, honey, thank bunny. You. Hope you get snatched up super soon. <laughs> Awesome. Well, hey, if you guys want to go check out Honey Bunny or any of the other amazing pets over there at the Humane Society of Washington County, as always, go check out their page at Humane Society of Washington County on Facebook or hswcmd.org over online. You can see their full adoption gallery, their hours, events, and you can donate to help out some of those amazing pets like Honey Bunny as well. Thanks for watching another episode of the podcast. We'll see you back again coming up next Wednesday.